Hi everybody, I'm Hayden Crawford from numerologist.com and I'm a wellness coach specializing in color therapy. Today I'm going to be guiding you through a 144 crystalline grid activation so that you can reconnect to the higher consciousness of everybody else on the planet. You may have heard of Dolores Cannon, a quantum hypnotist and author of a series of groundbreaking metaphysical books detailing the arrival of three waves of volunteers who have come to the planet since the end of World War II their mission to assist with the ascension process into 5D consciousness. Now, she also details a smaller group of approximately 10,000 souls who she calls the keepers of the grid, who are here to repair and rebuild a crystalline energy structure which surrounds our planet. Now, these are completely unaware of the work that they do and it's often done during sleep state so they can wake up in the morning feeling really tired and exhausted. But are you one of these keepers of the grid? Well, let's first take a look at exactly what the 144 crystalline grid is all about. The planetary crystalline grid is an aspect of the new 5D consciousness matrix. It receives this beautiful ascension light, this divine light from the center of our galaxy and then disperses it in equal proportions around our planet. Now, each one of us is a co-creator of this gorgeous diamond white ascension light. And we are able to affect the crystalline grid. The more people that connect up to it, the more impact it has. So it actually has infinite potential. And that's where the 144 comes from. Not only is it a master number for ascension, but it's also the tipping point of when we get 144,000 people connected to the grid and really truly feeling its power and energy, then we literally will ascend into 5D. So it's, we've got everything to play for. Now the way to really consolidate this is to activate codes, these ascension codes, and we can do that and then ground it into our physical body and our location and then shine it through the realms of our hearts. I'm gonna show you how to do this very shortly. Let's explore this extremely beautiful geometric crystalline grid in more detail first. You know that we have reached a time where it's absolutely critical to not only clarify, but to embody the concept of unification so that we can synchronize all of our heart-mind intents into one giant intent. This is gonna be extremely powerful and we've got to recognize that we're all on that same mission to be able to help the planet raise into 5D. So we need to move away from our individual efforts and create a collaboration which is going to increase the speed of this transformation and it's going to create one large grid of infinite powerful potential. By synchronizing with the grid, we're going to be able to receive and exchange information that will accelerate the evolution of our species by working as a collective. We're gonna be able to support this network of light and ultimately build an intergalactic bridge. Each one of us is a human portal and we're gonna be able to build our own networks within our own tribe and geographical location will ultimately connect up together, rippling out into the world and opening the hearts and affecting the conscious awareness of each individual on the planet. The aim is to amplify the power of light so much on Earth that there will be a vibrational shift and it will ultimately eradicate any conflict or destruction. This powerful light has the capabilities of being able to impact and transform each and every single living person on the planet. The grid connects our crystals, major portals, matrices and dimensional doorways from our Earth to other cosmic forces and multi-dimensional realities. Now, where the grid lines cross over can sometimes be found the Earth's pyramids or other spiritual sites. And this is because the power is amplified where the energy centers cross over and the ancients knew that. This really is the foundation and the anchor of the new world consciousness matrix. This powerful grid of diamond light 
is a higher dimensional structure that has always been there for our use. And over the years, many beings have supported and assisting with the rebuilding of this structure so, so that we can go back to that multi-dimensional reality that they experienced during the time of Atlantis. So let's take a look at the five main purposes of the grid. Well, number one is that it's a platform for the energies of the new earth. Number two is that it connects the higher consciousness of humans globally. Number three is that it acts as a transitory bridge assisting the planetary shift. Number four is that it is a multi-dimensional communication system and cosmic internet. And finally, number five is that it is a library holding the wisdom and knowledge of the planet. Remember, it's essential that we consciously connect to the grid so that we can transmit higher and brighter light frequencies. The more of us that are doing this collectively, the higher the vibration will go. So we're going to be able to take more and more souls across the bridge. There are many locations around the Earth that act as central power stations. And these destinations would be places like Uluru, Stonehenge, Mount Shasta, and of course the pyramids. Now we can connect up to this energy on a daily basis, and this will help to accelerate this process, but also we can redirect the energy to certain people, places, and events. We can also utilize this energy to recharge our own batteries so that we've got the power to be able to fulfill our missions. As mentioned, the grid is a storehouse of all of the knowledge of the planet, and this can be harnessed by us anytime we choose. It will really help us to express our truest divine potential so that we can go on to help with the process of awakening humanity. So let's have a look at the 10 reasons of why we should use the grid. Number one is to send love to yourself and others daily. Number two is to instantly connect with others. Number three is to assist with planetary transformation. Number four is to activate latent coding. Number five is to access the language of light. Number six is to develop your telepathic skills. Mwah. Number seven is to reconnect unity consciousness. Number eight is to develop skills in expanded consciousness. Number nine is to communicate with other dimensional light intelligences. And finally, number 10 is that it enables interdimensional travel. So are you ready for your 144 crystalline grid code activation? This meditation for energy connection, transferal and activation of the crystalline grid will help you to access these ascension codes of awakening so that you can anchor them and transmit them through the realm of your heart. First, find a place to sit or to lie comfortably where you won't be disturbed for about the next five minutes. Just relax and start to concentrate on your breath. Breathing in peace as a white light, holding, and then breathing out any tension or anxiety as a dark cloud. Slowing everything down, becoming aware of the weight of your body either on a chair or on the floor and listening out to any sounds that you can hear, both close up and far away. Take a very deep breath in and slowly let your heart light expand. Flow the energy in a beam, a corridor of light energy traveling all the way through your body, through your third eye, 
your throat, your heart, your solar plexus, your sacral, and your base, and then down the legs and into the core of the earth. And then watch as it travels back up through the body and back to source. From the core of the earth, visualize the white light energy flashing into an infinity of light frequencies. Watch as it feeds into the crystalline 144 ascension grid. Ask the gatekeepers of the highest integrity to support you in linking with the crystalline grid. Experience the ecstasy as your vibration lifts and allow it to flow through you. Allow the frequency of your body and mind to meld into and adjust to the frequency of the crystalline grid. When you are ready, place the intention I now download into my highest quality DNA the ascension codes and frequencies, the divine light and activations that will most serve me and all humanity, and I call forth the downloads from the crystalline grid and receive them in through my crown chakra and into my heart. Feel your heart bursting with light as you receive the crystalline codes available to you right now. Feel this divine light energy move down through the crystalline column to the core of Gaia. Your energy is now grounded to Mother Earth. Take a deep breath in and feel your connection to this beautiful planet. Now breathe the light back up into your heart and shine forth the codes of awakening, the frequency of light consciousness. Share this blissful divine diamond white light to all of those who are willing to receive. Remember that what you are giving out is returning to you tenfold. The joy and ecstasy you are experiencing will stay with you for the rest of the day. Take another deep breath in, hold and then breathe out. And as I count back from five to one, you're going to re-enter the space around you, feeling better than before with a renewed sense of inner peace, clarity and love. Five, four, three, two and one. And then in your own time, opening your eyes. Welcome back. Wow, I bet you feel amazing now, don't you? Well, look, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and don't forget to watch my next one. I'll see you very soon. Bye for now.